EU agriculture ministers have discussed developments in Europe's milk sector, weighing its long-term future with quotas due to end next year. At their council in Luxembourg, the European Commission presented a report on the so-called milk package, which entered force in 2012 and is meant to cater for the sector's future. This is the last year of the quota system. The conditions on the market are good and that led to an overshoot of quotas in many of the member states. And those member states believe that there needs to be a smooth transition to a new system in order to avoid disruptions on the market. Now, other member states are against taking any measures whatsoever before the quota system expires because they believe that this would penalize those who have actually stuck to the rules for milk production. The supply of fruit, vegetables and milk to Europe's schools was also on the menu. The ministers discussed work already done towards new rules governing the aid scheme for the supply of these foods, which have important nutritional benefits for children. Milk, fruit and vegetable schemes were introduced in Europe in 1977 and 2007, Ministers voiced support for merging them to increase efficiency and effectiveness. Fisheries ministers, meanwhile, took stock of measures aimed at ensuring that fishermen bring all their catches to land and eliminating the practice of discarding them at sea. The discard ban is one of the key measures of the common fisheries policy, which was reformed last year and should apply from early 2015. The Commission briefed ministers on the state of play of member states' discard plans prepared at the regional level, with new kinds of fish stocks to be subject to landing obligations next year.